Hi guys, it's the adventurous allotment here, here again. I'm on my allotment and I've got my trusty paintbrush because what I'm going to do now is I'm going to pollinate some of my flowers. And the reason I'm doing that on this little shrub here, where all these flowers are, the reason why I'm the reason why I'm doing that is simply because we do not have the pollinators in this country to be able to pollinate them. So I have to do it myself with this, and I have to basically be the pollinator. So I'm just going to go around on the shrub here if you can see i'm just gonna like take some of the some of the nectar from each one and make sure that this pollen is evenly distributed around the plant to give it the best or best possible chance of developing fruit because that's what i want i want the fruit here just certainly up here there's another one there's plenty of fresh pollen here it's funny because i'm doing this with a paintbrush and if you look closely these plants have, I don't know whether you can see them, but they have these little tubes here, and that's where the um, hummingbirds get the nectar from. Just there. But uh, well, I'm not a hummingbird, and I don't need nectar. I've got plenty of sugary snacks in the house. But, uh, <laughs> but yeah, so I'll keep on, keep on brushing these, and hopefully, hopefully you'll be greeted by some really tasty fruit towards the winter. So some of these are the funny thing is I've only just got around to doing this um, and I'd noticed that like if if the if the plant isn't pollinated or the, the, the pollinators don't get to the plant the flower heads just fall off and so do the um, the potential the ovaries the the egg you know the the, uh, the part that produces the fruit it tends to fall off and um, then that means you won't get the fruit obviously but I've noticed with this that some of them are not falling off and that suggests that they've been pollinated already and I'm interested to know by what because um, as far as I'm aware there's nothing in this country that will pollinate these so either we've got something walking around or flying around pollinating them or or the wind maybe I don't know it's really weird because uh, they shouldn't be being pollinated by anything but this brush really but we'll see anyway now you know what I've done and hopefully hopefully this will get some results uh, for this uh, for, for the fruit later on but just to let you know what I was doing with this and uh, I'll be back with another video soon so thanks for watching please leave a like and uh, subscribe to the channel if you like the content and uh, yeah like I said I'll be back with another video soon see you later